What is up guys, Zach in here and in today's video, I am being super selfish today and I want to explain why I'm being super selfish. I, I want to explain what I'm doing and how me being selfish in this video is actually going to probably give you one of the most valuable live streams, uh, valuable videos you have probably ever had on this channel. And this is what I'm going to do. Let me just give you the facts. All right. I currently have a deal where somebody sent over and they gave me an emergency. They said, Hey, I have a deal. My inspection period is basically going to be up in 48 hours. And I need to make sure I have a buyer ready to go within 48 hours. So I can have a complete, a complete, just truthfulness in my heart. When I extend it to tell that seller, I have everything and me and my partner are ready to buy it. And this brings something interesting. I got to get this deal done because I think I could probably make ten, fifteen thousand dollars on this deal. And I was like, shoot, I got 48 hours to get this thing done. What am I going to do? So this is where we're at right now. I am here to basically show you, break down and explain this deal, how I'm going to go on this live stream and how I'm actually going to sell this deal to you guys and show you how I do it. And you're going to just kind of go over my shoulder and see the entire wholesaling real estate process. That is the point today. And that is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to sell a real life deal in front of you. And this is me being selfish. I'm going to hopefully try to make 15 grand right now in an assignment fee. And you're going to watch me and you're going to see me try to do my best to make money off of it. Right? So uh, this deal is in Florida and I will uh, show you part of it. So I decided to myself, I said, you know what? Let me make a video series of me doing a full documentary of me going from the start to finish of the entire deal. Showed how we got the deal locked up, showed the price, comps, pictures, ARV, showed actual comparables, show what good comps are, bad comps. I did the whole nine yards on this one. And I decided to myself, I said, you know what? Let's do the entire thing. And uh, I did part one and this is going to be part two. And I was like, all right, now I can just click the record button at, at my place and spend, you know, an hour and a half, two hours to find a buyer on this one and then just edit up, chop it up and make it like a nice 10 minute video, right? Out of two hours. Or how about I just live stream me doing it and then for the part two, we can have my editors chop it up and make it good for like a nice recorded video uh, so you get straight into the action for that. And this is what we're at right now. We have a deal locked up. We got to sell the deal. And what I'm doing today is I'm not having my team do it. I'm going to be doing it. And you're going to see how I can go out here and get the deal done. So uh, without further ado, let's get it going. I'm going to uh, basically do a real life wholesaling deal. And so this is where we're at. This is what I'm doing. And uh, I'm excited. So guys, before we break it down, do me a big favor. Make sure you guys smash the like button. Hit that subscribe button. Comment below all your questions. Love to help you out. And this is a live video, right? So I'm going to do live cold calling. We're going after this one area. And we're just getting after it, right? I got my phone. We're going to go get this deal done. And I uh, do it live in front of you because I feel like that's where the most value is for everybody. So uh, without further ado, let's get it going, guys. You know, before we get it going, I got to get you guys hyped up, get you guys excited to start wholesaling houses. So without further ado, here's the intro. Get the fuck out of bed, bitch. Go. Wake up, bitch, get up. Get up, get up, get up. Get up. Let's get it, guys. So uh, going out here, getting ready. So uh, let me get the skinny in the deal really quick. So uh, on the actual video I've been doing, I gave you the full address. I did the whole thing. I'm not giving out the address publicly right now on this live stream. I'll give you the zip code. Okay, this is a nice off-market deal. It's a rental property. 
It's getting around, I think, eight fifty a month, uh, eight hundred a month. And what I want to do is, um, when you watch the live stream, uh, sorry, when you watch the actual video series, the address will pop up, the real examples, everything like this. Now, if I do it publicly, I'll get the deal stolen, and I do not want that. I got too many followers on here, uh, so we're going to keep it to the zip code, and we're going to find buyers in that zip code first, and then we're just going to make our rounds. Now, if when you watch the part one of the series, you're going to see that I figured out very quickly that I could make more money selling this to a landlord buyer than a house slipper buyer. The comp show on a cap rate scale, this is a really good, it's a very good rental property deal. If I buy this just purely off a of rental and appreciation, it's a good deal. If I buy this to flip, it's not the best, right? And so the best comps I found are cash flow comps on the property. And so that's basically what I, I'm going to do today is I'm going to go try to sell this deal. We're going to find buyers together and we're going to do it all. And I'm, I'm excited. So uh, without further ado, let's get this deal sold. Uh, I'm excited for it. So it is in Pensacola, Florida. That's basically it. It's in Pensacola, Florida, and uh, I'm excited. So it's in the 32505 zip code. And so that's what I'm going to do first. Since I want to find, I figure out the cap rate's really good on this property. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to the Zillow and I'm going to find the four rents. Let's go after landlord cash buyers first and find the four rents from them. And then we're just going to keep going down the list and find cash buyers together. And we're going to call them. We're going to ask questions. We're going to do the whole thing. Remember, I'm not perfect. These are live calls. And uh, we're going to see what we do. So uh, without further ado, let's get it going. Let's, uh, we're in Zillow here. And so I'm usually at the four sales, but we're going to go to the four rents in the area. And uh, we do all of them, right? Screw it, right? And we're going to go by newest and uh, really see what we can do. And so uh, this is, so when I'm looking here, guys, I'm just letting everybody know, this obviously right here is, let's see. Let's see. All right. So this is a property management solution company. So obviously you don't want to deal with a property manager right now on this. So I can see here, property management, no. Go here. See if we got any names on this, right? That's sort of the point. All right, let's see if we make some calls. Now, Zillow's getting a lot worse with these. Like, it's getting harder to call. So they just want you to apply. No. That's got to load up here. And I got William Haskins. Perfect. So what we're going to do is we're just going to call these people up and try to see if I can sell this deal. Since this is Zillow, they're not going to call me back because they get their own phone number on it. So we're just going to keep going down the line here. All right. We're going down the most recent uh, Zillow listings. Uh, this is from a realty company. Now let's go here. Hello, hi. Uh, I'm looking for a uh, Zachary Cooper. Uh, may I ask who's calling? Yeah, this is actually, uh, Z my name's Zach. I'm actually looking for the owner of this rental listing here. Uh, what's the property address? Uh, 2010 Downing Drive. Okay, give me just one moment. Okay. I'm not talking to the receptionist, all right? <laughs> 
Yeah, really. How can we help? Hey, Zach. How's it going? Uh, my name's Zach, too. So uh, FYI, uh, so I'm not copying your name or anything. But um, I'm calling here on a rental listing, and I'm guessing you're the agent representing the owner to have it for rent, right? That's correct. Okay. Yeah. So uh, I'll make it short and sweet with you. Um, I'm a wholesaler, and I have a rental property. I think it's getting about eight fifty a month in that zip code. And I was just wondering if you had any clients that are looking for more rental properties. Obviously, I'd like to pay you uh, for being the buyer on that. But I was just letting you know that I do have a property on a contract for that. And if you have any clients, uh, I'd love to work with you. Uh, and you said you have a property that you're purchasing that is renting for eight fifty a month? Yes, it's renting for eight fifty a month right now. Obviously, it needs some renovations, but... I do see some comps showing you could probably push it to twelve, thirteen hundred a month. You're probably a lot better at that than me figuring that out. Uh, but yeah, it's, I'm a wholesaler, so I have it under contract right now. Me and my partner. Oh, I got you. Yeah, I'd, I'd love to help you, buddy. But unfortunately, I don't don't have any buyers this time. Ah, okay. Well, I appreciate it, uh, Zachary. So uh, if anything changes, you got my number here and uh, give me a call. Yeah, have a good day. All right, thanks. So that, guys and gals, is how you just talk to a real estate agent and just what I call putting your feelers out there, right? L let me know if you guys can hear it. Uh, make sure the mic is all the way up so you guys can hear it. All right. I just I made it a little louder, so if I scream, uh, don't, don't be mad at me. But the point is I just want to make some calls here to real estate agents and try to get this deal sold. So let's keep going on here. And that's the point. So like, I'm, I'm getting a question like, why is he doing the four rents? I'm doing the four rents because this is a really good rental property I got. And the best buyer is going to be a landlord buyer on this situation. So uh, let's go here and let's keep going down the line here. Uh, Realty Masters, no. Nick. I like Nick. Nick seems like an actual owner. Good and prepare and Maple Leaf Home Services. The fastest way to reach me is to shoot me a text first and uh, we'll set up a time to call. Hope you're having a great day. Happy holidays. Bye bye. All right. Let's go here. Versailles. Oh, it looks like it's Versailles. Uh, realtor. The cheaper ones are actually kind of better. All right. Hey, this is Zach. Give me a call back whenever you can. Thanks. Let's see here. All right. Honestly, the older the listing, sometimes the better. So we're just going to keep going down the line here. Zach? Hello? 
Hello, hey, is this the owner of uh, – I'm just trying to confirm this. This is uh, the house in Petros Circle? Yes. Yeah, do you, yeah hi. Do you, are you the owner? Do you have this property for rent right now? Yeah, I mean, there is someone that's supposed to move in. He's uh, put a deposit, but they haven't set up a move-in date yet. So they, uh, I'm not sure they are still moving in. Okay. Well, actually, the reason why I'm calling you is I'm actually a wholesaler and I have a property under contract that's renting for around eight fifty a month that I have under contract. And I'm just looking for any other people looking to possibly buy that deal from me and any landlords because it's got a really good cap rate and it's got a lot of really good potential. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, I might be interested. Okay. Oh. 850 sounds kind of low these days. Yeah, I mean, it, I, I'll tell you for a fact, uh, you can get a good cap rate. Now, the truth is it's a value-add property. So I think if you put around twenty five into it, you could probably get thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars a month in rent. Uh, but it's, it's on its own. It's a 3-2. It's a little older property, but I think it was built in like the 60s. But it's definitely, a, it's a cash cow. And I, I think it's something that uh, you would probably want. Okay. Do you want to email me some information? Yeah, sure. Um, is this the right number to text you at? Yeah, it is. Okay. I'll go text you my information and uh, we'll see. Okay. You can look at the property. I got lots of pictures, videos, all that thing, all that stuff. And if it's something you're interested in, uh, please let me know because I am having people look at it next week. Uh, the closing would probably be in 30 days. Gotcha. Okay. okay. Sounds good. Yeah. yeah. And what we... Sure it's over and anything else you have, you can also send that my way. I'm, I'm local and I, I live actually live in Pensacola, so... Awesome. Uh, oh. Right yeah. And what's your name? My name is Emmett. Emmett? Okay. All right. Nice to meet you, Emmett. This is Zach. Uh, you'll receive a call from me in, a, in an email shortly. Uh, I'm actually all over Florida. So my partner is in Pensacola and that's how he got it under contract. And I'm reaching out to people, there's landlords okay. in the area trying to sell that deal. I got you. Yeah, if you also have some stuff in uh, like a multi-family thing in Tallahassee, I'll, I'll be happy to look at that as well. Perfect. Okay. Well, uh, let me go shoot you over a text and I can go text you all my information. And I don't know if this is on a Zillow number okay. or something, but... Um, Worst case scenario, I'll give you a call back in a couple hours just to get more info. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you don't see the you don't see the right number. Let me give you the number. Okay. I'm not sure not by number what you see over there because they give like a they put a fictitious number so no one will I don't know. Yeah. Um, I don't think you can text the number over there. So it's eight five zero. All right, perfect. I'll give you a text right now, and uh, just and then my name is Zach, so just text me over email, and I'll send you all the info on the deal. Okay, sounds good. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you. Boom. All right, we are 19 minutes in, and we have our first cash buyer. So let's go, let's go, guys. All right, first cash buyer, and get that deal sold to him. Hopefully, uh, have him go look at it, but. Number one, we got it. So uh, let's get it going. Uh, shout out to Emmett. And uh, the reason why I tell you is this is why I tell everybody to go cold call the four rents. Because yes, you're going to call like 10. They're all going to suck. But you're going to find one that's like, yeah, I'm looking to buy more rental properties. That is the point. That See, he wasn't interested on the comps. He was interested on the purchase price and the cash flow. This is cool. I'm being selfish today, but hopefully you get value from me making my own money and get it going. So Ramon says 19 minutes. I can beat that. You probably can, but that's because I'm doing it by myself. I, I, I like having a team do it, but you know, I, I, I got to flex on a guru. I'm sorry. Hey, I, I got to flex on a guru. That's the stuff I like doing. 
And uh, you know, I ain't done. We, we got to really get this deal done. So uh, let's, let's get some more buyers on it. And let's see, you see how this is a $1,300 uh, a month. I definitely think I could get more. So uh, let's go some lower ones. Keep calling here. Let's talk to Ross. And so I do want everybody to know this. In Zillow, they give you a fake number so you don't get spammed, okay? So I used to have my real number on Zillow and I used to get calls from realtors for years. And so what Zillow did was if I have a, you know, a 431-2222 phone number, Zillow put their own fake number on there and it'll get routed to me, kind of like a call rail. And the point of that is so you don't get spammed like crazy. So, uh, all right, let's, let's keep going. Let's keep calling here. So I'm looking for cheap rent because my property is pretty cheap. Even that uh, landlord said it. And so uh, let's keep going here and let's start selling this deal. And so... All right, let's go. And I hope you guys are following like kind of my script with it. Zach, I'm just saying a script of, hey, I got a property under contract. And I'm looking to sell that contract. Are you looking to buy more rentals? It's really simple conversation. Like it's not complicated. So obviously some don't want to pick up, whatever. We're just going to keep going down the line here and get this thing done. Hello. Hello, hi. Is this the owner of 2506 West Jackson Street? Yeah, it is. Hello, hi. My name is Zach. Uh, so, is this Ross? Yeah. Oh, hey, Ross. Hey. Um, so, I'm calling here. I'm actually not looking to rent the property out. I'm actually a wholesaler, and me and my partner have a property under contract. It's getting around eight fifty a month in rent, and we're looking to see if there's okay. any landlords in the area looking to buy it. I mean, I'm, I'm always looking to buy. Um, what? And you're. You already have a tenant in place, is that right? Yeah, there's a tenant in place right now. Okay. Do you know when his um, his rent expired? Lease expired? Uh, it's month to month. Okay. Um, I mean, I'm always open to. I'm only you know open to new property because we're actually buying uh, a couple properties further north. It depends on what neighborhood it is and what the asking price. Okay. So you said new property, like. Like newer construction or like just new property? No, 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 no. Additional, additional property. Ah, okay, yeah. So, so like, you know, anywhere from you know, to you know, newer. Okay. Well, this one's definitely a value add. So it's getting eight fifty a month. Most likely, yeah. this is my guess. You would probably have to kick the tenants out, put some money into it, and then mm -hmm. rent it out for thirteen, fourteen hundred a month. Um, but obviously, you, you know what's best for you better than anyone so uh would you be interested in me just kind of shooting you over the address and just looking at the pictures and seeing if it's something that's a yes or no from you yeah um i'm talking to other uh wholesalers now uh and they're just shooting me a few addresses we i know pretty well the area so if you know it's a nice neighborhood then i'll be able to put it in a, you know oh. i just don't know what the neighborhood is yeah so I, I can just send you the address this is in the same zip code um but obviously you know, Pensacola varies everywhere. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let me know. Well, all right. So I see your name's Ross here. I know this is a Zillow number. Is it okay if you uh, give me your uh, number and I can text you over my email? And then we can I can just email you the info and the pictures and everything like that? Okay, uh, what's your number? 260-567-5566. Right, perfect. I appreciate it, Ross. Uh, my name is Zach, and so um, I will be in contact with you. Are you part of a larger group of, uh, of uh, or are you guys independent? I mean, we're, I do it all over the country. And so I actually have a buddy that locked up this deal and he needs help with it. So I'm Hello. just kind of uh, calling some landlords around the area and just seeing if the Hello. feelers out here. 
Can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about that. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, yeah. Did you get the number? Yeah, I got the number right here. Yeah. So, are you part of a larger group of uh, wholesalers, or are you guys independent? I'm pretty much as nationwide as they get. I just had a buddy that had a deal locked up there, and he just he's kind of like, I need to get this thing done. I'm like, all right, let me reach out to some landlords in the zip code and just kind of see what I can do. Okay, perfect. So uh, you said the number was. That's right. All right. Appreciate it. Thank you so much, Ross. I'll shoot you over the information as soon as I can. All right. Thank you. All right. Two. Let's go. Yeah. All right. Let's keep it going. Guys, I want you to understand, like, I don't make it look easy. I just do the work. And so what's the work here? Literally. Hey, I have a deal under contract. Are you looking to buy any more rental properties? Yes or no? Guys, these people already have rentals. Most likely, they're making money on some rentals and they got extra cash and they're like, oh, I own some rentals. Let me buy some more. Duh. And this deal, like I showed you, like you're going to see in part one of the video, like this is really like in part one of the video, I figured out that this is not a good flipping deal. And I show you exactly why in the video, right? I can't give you the address. I can't give you the address yet. But um, like on it, like you're going to see very easily in this video, uh, in that, in that, in the series I got here that like, this is a rental cash cow. And if you can figure out this thing's already getting rental property on it, it's going to be amazing. So, um, it's good. I'm telling you, um, this is, I guys, I don't tell you to go cold call the four rents because I think it's cool. I'm going to sell you a court. I do it because it works. All right. Like. Guys, this is me at 18 years old in my dorm room, just finding buyers on Zillow all day, every day. Like I live this business. I do what I say. I do this business for real. Why do you think I have a Facebook group? It's called Wholesaling Houses for Real. Because I wholesale houses for stinking real. All right. I hope you guys understand that. I do this business for real. I'm not a quitter. I'm not a guru. I'm none of these things. All right. I just, I hate when these gurus go out here and they, they try their stupid, like little thing. I'm like, nah, all right. That's legit. I do this for real. I ain't no broke guru. I ain't doing that stupid stuff. I'm here to help the people out. So let's, uh, let's keep it going. Let's keep the, let's get the party rolling. All right. I'm having a good time right now. Okay. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm loving it. Right. I'm, I'm doing good. I think it's really cool. Nobody in this business has really done a start to finish guide on, um, wholesaling deals in a very long time. And so I want to be the person that starts that up again, right? I made a documentary, I think, a year and a half ago of uh, me doing a deal from start to finish. Uh, that was an in-person real estate deal. Whenever I understand, I, I have a documentary on the Flip of Earth YouTube channel. I actually did a start to finish guide on wholesaling where I locked up the deal. I showed you, I went to the appointment, I think a year and a half ago, two years ago, two years ago, probably. No, a year and a half. I met with a cash buyer. I recorded me with the cash buyer at the property with the seller. I recorded me going the deal. I remember I recorded me getting the check. That is actually all in uh, Flippeth Rick if you go on the playlists. But I was like, all right, how do I one up myself? Because what, t- what did I say on my live stream on Sunday? The only person that can beat me is myself. The only person that could beat me is me. And I can't even stop myself. All right. Like I, I go too hard in the paint sometimes. And so that being said, duh. I'm going to do a virtual one and that's what I'm doing now. So let's, let's keep this party rolling. You know, I, I, I don't, I don't want to stop this party. Party. Yeah. 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 All right. So we're going here. Listed by brokerage. Screw that. Nick Singleton did not have his number here. And unfortunately home rental pros. Who's home rental pros? Property management company. Shoot. Okay. No big deal. All right. Let's go here. All righty. Perfect. All right. So let's go out here. All right. So it looks like we are out. If you look here, we are currently out of... uh, we're out of the zip, so we gotta go. We gotta get out of the zip a little more, and so 
What does this mean? We just got to do all of uh, Pensacola, so that's fine. So let's go here. Pensacola. So we're going to do all the rentals in Pensacola, and we're just going to go buy cheap rents now. And I think that's going to be our best thing. If these guys are already buying rental properties for cheap, it'll be good. So let's go buy newest listings. Let's max out the price at 1500 a month and see what we got. So I already called this person. So let's go some of the cheap real estate. So this is already getting, so this is my mindset. You know, I, I, I think stupid sometimes, but it's the absolute truth. Uh, if someone's already getting 925 a month, they want to probably buy another cash lot at 825. And remember, because the rent's cheap, you're going to buy it for really cheap, right? That's the point. All right, so we're here. So it says Jake. Jake got me no number. So I'm going to skip talking to Jake. Oops. So listed by a brokerage. Probably a brokerage. Nope. All right. Got our boy Chris. Let's talk to Chris. Two, two, one. Eight five eight one. All right, let's go. Please leave your message for eight five zero two two one eight. All right. Talk to Monique. Island? Hello. Hello. Hi. Is this uh, the owner of fifteen hundred Johnson Avenue? Yes, this is. Hello. Hi. So this is Monique. Yes, this is. Okay. Hi. Hi. This is Zach. Uh, I'm calling on the rental listing here. I'm not actually looking to rent the property out. I'm actually a wholesaler, and I have a property under contract in Pensacola uh, that is a rental property currently. And I'm seeing there's any landlords are looking to buy any more properties uh in the area and just seeing that oh interesting um so are you looking to purchase or are you looking to i'm looking to what sell my happen? deal so i have a contract right now for a rental property in pensacola and i was seeing if anyone's oh, looking okay. to buy more rentals and so specifically for you are you looking to buy any more rentals in pensacola Okay, no big deal. Well, if anything changes, uh, I can text you over my phone number. And if you're looking for a good rental, these are off-market deals. So they're going to be for really cheap. Uh, better than anything you get on the MLS. So um, if anything changes, I'll text you over my phone number and uh, let me know. Okay, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Have a great one. You too. So I'm not, I'm not trying to sell or anything. But like I, I kind of like, – I don't – you know, I, I got people in Pensacola that do the deals with me, but I just kind of doing it for you guys. You got to explain to these buyers too, that if like, uh Oh, got a little water situation, just a little water, no big deal. Give me one second. Give me one second here, guys. I spilled water. That's not good. I get a towel. Yeah, I need a towel. Thank you. Your towel, please. All right. I think I spilled water, so. Hold up. All right, we're fine. All right. All right, no big deal. I spilled some water on the computer. I think it was the first I've ever done that, but whatever. All right. Whoa. <laughs>
All right. All right, let's keep calling while I do this, all right? Yikes. All right, we're back on. Put it in rice. All right, I'm going to keep calling while I dry this thing out, all right? All right. All right, let's get back to calling here while I do this. All right, let's go. All right, Palm Island Realty, no. I think this, all right, now we're good. All right, let's go here. Palm Island, no. Is my audio? Yeah, all right. Sorry about that, guys. All right. Okay. See, Palm Island's got all these under contract. All right, um... They got all these for rent. That's a property manager right there. Yeah. All right. So William has a good one while I look at the other one. So what is a cap rate? What's the cap rate on that deal? Uh, actually, let me do the math on it. Let me figure out the cap rate. That's actually a good question. So I did it on that first video, but if I... So cap rate's different. So, so you guys understand there's different ways to calculate what a cap rate would be. Uh, to the right buyer. So in my personal opinion, cap rate is going to be... So cap rate just profit after everything. I don't include depreciation in cap rate. I don't include... I mean, personally to myself, I just figure out... I mean, it's net operating income. Uh, so a lot of people put taxes and stuff and incentives, stuff like I just put, hey, how much should I buy it for? How much going to make him profit every year, right? Appreciation would be IRR, internal rate of return for me. Um, but honestly, it just depends what you can get in rent for it. So honestly, I would say it's about an 11 cap. If you put appreciation and all that stuff, you can make it sexy, look like it's 16, 17%, but everyone's always a little different with that. All right, let's keep finding buyers here. All right, computer's fine now. Let's 
All right. Uh, where's the next one? Here it is. No, no, no. All right, Oksana. Hey, this is Zach. Give me a call back whenever you can. Thanks. All righty. Let's go here. Uh, Skip. Who's Skip? I guess Skip's a name, right? South properties. No, no, no. Nope. No. Blurry pick. This looks like a scam. All right. This is a good one. This is a cheap real estate right here. Nope. Did I do this one? No. Hmm. These are all management companies. We're trying to get some legit people. Okay. No. No. Hey, this is Zach. Give me a call back. Thanks. All right, let's see here. This thing is like no pictures.
Hello? Hey, yes, hi. Is this the owner of 3841 Spanish Trail Place? Yes, it is. Hello, uh, so I'm looking for, a, so this is Wayne? Yes, it is. Hey, Wayne, this is Zach. I'm actually not looking to rent any more properties out. I'm actually a wholesaler, and I have a deal in oh. Pensacola. All right. I guess that didn't go well with him. <laughs> See, if he wasn't intrigued on that and he's not like, if the buyer isn't intrigued at all that you're a wholesaler and you potentially could have more good deals for him, it ain't going to be good at all. So yeah, once I get uh, that wholesaling deal from start to finish, actually no, you go to Flip with Rick on YouTube and you go to the playlist, it should be on there. Or just search wholesaling documentary flip with Rick. It should be on there. But what was I going to say? Yeah, but the one I'm doing right now, let's get the deal sold first and then we cannot release the video. All right, next one. No big deal, but hey, whatever. Uh, we all make mistakes. So what I'm going to do is um, if you guys want uh, comments, I'll be in the comments right here. And uh, tomorrow we'll just have a regular live. Uh, Rick will be on tomorrow. And uh, we're just going to talk about wholesaling houses, right? He'll go on tomorrow because I got to do a live stream Friday. So that'd be pretty cool. So what we're going to do is that was today. And so I want you to understand that is how I found my cash buyers. Pretty simple, right? All I had to literally do was go to Zillow, go to the four rents and find cash buyer landlords. That is the point, guys and gals. If you find the cash buyer landlords, they're going to be there. They're going to be there. I I'm telling you right now. They are there sitting, waiting for you to go attack. So if you have a deal and you have it, you're stuck. You got to get the deal locked up and you have it locked up and you got to get the assignment of contract done. Go to Zillow, go to the four rents. That is how you're going to find the landlord buyers are going to overpay on the property. So uh, sorry for the little technical difficulties. Uh, promise everything will be all good tomorrow. We're going to have bottle caps, so don't worry about it. But um, always funny, you know, you know, we're live, anything can happen live. So I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe, go to freelancing.com and I'll see you guys soon. Appreciate everyone's patience. Thank you.